I love it when Jelly Baby gets to sit in the pink corner. It's <laughs> it's uh, like a popping pink lemonade. In this case, uh, going up against like a two, blue raspberry, three, blue razzmatazz two, kind of situation. One, Interesting one, matchup two, here. You don't see Jelly Baby running any sort of wedge, just going straight in with forks against a horizontal spinner. And winning the first engagement here as Radix, uh, nothing doing against the front setup. No, this is a very uh, effective wedge situation, and Radix is a robot that gets very destabilized very oh, fast. Big hit to the top of Jelly Baby there, but it doesn't seem to have done anything. No, I, remember, that Jelly Baby name is not just for fun. It is a squishy robot in a lot of places. Yeah. And that padding takes a lot of punishment. A nice little self right there. It was fun when the robot can flip itself back over. Jelly Baby's robot uh, flipper, uh, deceptively fast, a uh, little pop it can give people. Just toss them up a little bit. Doesn't seem to even need it here. It's just able to send Radix flying using Radix's own uh, kinetic energy. Yeah, it is both fast and powerful and unnecessary at the moment, yeah. although I believe we'll see it here in just yeah. a second. It, it's if, uh, Radix really no answer yes. for the shape on Jelly Baby. You see a little flip there, just waiting the waiting out the pin counter. And that is Scoring the smart points. move here is you take that pin almost all the way up to the pin count exactly. limit, and then you pop your your weapon, your lifter, whatever it may be. Some people would say, like, why? Why wait? But uh, as a control bot, you want to show control and you, you want to run down the clock. Every second you're driving around is a second you could get smacked with that spinner in the wrong spot. So if you can hold that pin, you want to hold it and run down that clock while you're scoring points. Tremendous design here on Jelly Babel. He's able to drive Radix around the arena, almost teasing them. The weapon gets so close to the wheels here. Yeah, oh, that's the control. hit Radix wants on the back of Jelly Baby. And Jelly, Jelly Baby stuck under the wall, maybe. Yeah, it appears so. That is a bad place to be, oh. but they aren't there long. Radix, a little impatient, doesn't hit the juicy bits. However, How? left hand side drive on Jelly Baby, now out of commission, at least almost entirely. And I wonder if that was actually a result of that hit. Were they able to get the wheel there? It could be. It could be also something that broke while it was stuck trying to yeah. free itself. Well, uh, that's a big change in this fight with 40 seconds to go. I think this will end up getting to the judges. That's a massive swing in the damage score. As a control bot, you cannot give up damage, and that is going to hurt. They're yeah. also losing control points now, unable to keep going with their streak. They are certainly failing to gain them at the very least. The points that they gained early in the match will carry them oh. some way. And now, oh, okay, they come back to life a little bit. But with eight seconds left in the fight. Oh, big hit! Jelly Baby taking some big hits. That was Jelly Baby's fight, but my goodness, those last 30 seconds with an emphasis yep. on the last 10, everything turned around. I say this a lot with a control bot, you have to be perfect for three minutes. With a spinner, you only have to be perfect for about one second. You get those 